Srinivata Ramanujan Ayyengar. I heard that you're having a mass carnival. I have come here to wish you all the best. Since I have come, let me ask you some questions. Okay? First question. How many dots are there on a dais? If you answer my question, there will be a reward. Please come on to the dais. How many dots are there on a dais? Please come on to the dais. Ah. What's your name? You are right. Yes, my dear. Mathematics is poor. It does not rest or decay. It only needs your thought to make it work. Mathematics goes beyond the real world, yet the real world seems to be ruled by it. Mathematics often looks like a collection of symbols, but mathematics is not the symbol on the page, but what those symbols mean. And it doesn't matter what country you are from or what language you speak. If you are trained in mathematics, you will also understand what those symbols mean. Mathematics is a universal language. Work in robotics, invent the latest iPod or software for medical imaging. You'll need to understand all sorts of things involving geometry, search, mechanics, and probability. Otherwise, you may have to be prepared for quite a few rejection letters. If you put in the effort, however, the computer world will open up to you. Who knows? You may create a stunning new game. You may help great strides to be made in medicine. You could be sending probes into space or inventing software that helps people transport. Beam me up. <laughs> well, you never know. But you should know that an understanding of the fundamentals of computing... Come on, cheer up your friend! Let's 
get free from this battle. Otherwise, we can't play. Yes, Baza. So, dear friends, let's always remember that whenever we are in a bracket, we are tangled. So, first we must entangle ourselves and then follow the rule. So, you mean the bondman's rules? Both marks. So, dear friends, today we learn that.